Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. Last time, we got smacked by the Lucky Mallet, and became very, very tiny. And now we're traveling throughout the Emperor's Palace, and we just met Kaguya. And let's see what she has to say, I'm sorry I was very quiet. I was at a loss of words for a second. <laughs> anyway... But I'm afraid that's about all I can tell you. I don't know why I've been imprisoned here. I don't even know who I really am, or, why I or where I originally came from. Another babe. Oh, Ishin. How can Mr. Bamboo have such a cute granddaughter? Well, you just sit tight, honey pie. We'll get you out. The great Ishin's gonna straighten out that mean old emperor. Then I'll come back and set you free. No, I... Um... Don't sweat it, sweetie. You just sit tight. We're gonna search every nook and cranny of this palace. And I'm gonna give that emperor a piece of my mind when we find him. So don't you worry your pretty little head. My partner may not look like much now, but Furball here is, an a is actually the great Amaratsu. Now just sit back and relax. We've got it covered. Let's go, Ami. Awesome. We're doing stuff now. We're appar apparently Ishin wants to save Kaguya. Kaguya seems very nice. She also seems very tall. Uh, no, she's over here. Yeah, she seems very tall, but I guess she'd be normal sized if we weren't like super dinky. Which, well. We're super tiny, I guess, yeah. So, let's... Yeah, let's jam this lockjaw key into his... Yeah, take that lockjaw. Yeah, you're so weird and creepy. Thank you. Ugh. Let's find out what's in here. Looks like a secret room. There are acorns and a cicada husk. And more cicada husks. And a hole in... Well, a mound with a supposed hole in the ground, so... A mound with a supposed hole in the ground. You know what? I want there to be a hole in the ground, and I'm going to make one. I'm going to make a hole in this ground, and I'm determined. Thank you. So, just push you over there. No! I almost pushed it off the mound! Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm very skilled, as you can see. Uh, ooh, what's this? Strange. It's very secret down here. Jackpot! <laughs> Why would the Emperor hide his treasure here? I could smell it a mile away. Apparent, apparently, Ishin can smell treasure. I wish I was Ishin sometimes. Check out that funny looking thing, Ami. That's, why they call, that's what they call a platform spider. You see, they just go back and forth like that all day. They're basically harmless, unless you stay on their backs too long. Some of them don't like it, and they end up throwing you off. Well, I wouldn't like it if someone just happened to be just walking on top of me. It'd be kind of painful for my spine. Uh, hello, I hope you don't mind that I jump on you. There we go. It's like he's a plate, kind of. He's got- Oh, way to fall down. Okay. <laughs> Come back down. Hey there. Let's hop back up. And come back up here. Try number two. I'm so glad I have the holy eagle technique thing with the double jump. Or else there would be so many jumps that I'd just mess up. Can I dig up the clover? Where's the clover? Oh, that's a big clover. I hope it gives us big praise. It does give us big praise. 20 praise bubbles, blah, 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 blah. Yes, that was a lot of praise bubbles. Ooh, I fell down on my face. Okay, uh, hole in the wall. We'll check that out that out in a second. First, let's uh, examine the rest of this treasure area. Ew, look, stinky mushrooms. We haven't seen stinky mushrooms for a while. Good old stinky mushrooms from the Suta ruins. Um, are you gonna move? Okay. No, I forgot I had Holy Eagle. No way, ah. Forgot, I forgot I, I can double jump now and I don't have to touch a wall to to do that. Oh, let's climb this mushroom, please. Yes. There we go. And hop over here. There we go. And, oh, he's gonna throw us off. He's one of those that don't like it. Okay. 
What's up here? Maybe another clover. Yeah, there's a clover. I see it. With my eyes. It's a really big clover, too. Again. Or it's a normal size clover, but we're smaller. I need to stop trying to explain size, because it's not working out, as you can tell. Oh, come on. You know what? I'm going to use the thick paintbrush to do that. Come on. I have so many troubles trying to, like, revive these clovers. I'm just trying to make you healthier. No, I didn't mean to do Gale Storm. Come on. Oh, thank you. Okay. Um, is there a clover somewhere else? Yeah, there's one over there. Let's wait for this spider dude to come on over. We'll hop on his back. And no! No! I fell down again! Crap! Oh, we'll just have to try again now! Okay! Ah, oh, that was crazy. I'll try to be really fast. I'm sorry I keep failing hard. It's kinda... I kinda need to do a bit better on the jumping and the landing part. Ugh, I haven't played this for a while. I've been playing like... been playing like Sonic. Been playing some Sonic Unleashed. Pretty fun. Ugh. Ow, don't fall down. No. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this guy to come over. But yeah, I've been, I've been playing like other games for the other LPs. And I've been like... I've been having some fun. But I haven't, I haven't done Okami in a while. I've, I've, I need to practice up on my skills again. My jumping skills and leaping skills and all of that. Okay, we're going to revive this clover now. Thank, oh, thank you. There we go. Now we can check out this strange ground area. There we go. What's in here? Ooh, apparently I got a lot of stuff. That was nice. But, oh, it, there's purple mist in here and a really big pot. A flask! Oh, a flask, okay. <laughs> Is that considered treasure? Oh, no, spider, no way. Uh-oh, that's a blocking spider, Amy. Wonder why it got so bent out of shape all of a sudden. Now we're gonna have a heck of time getting out of here. Yeah, you're right, Ishin. Well, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to cut that rope, and the flask is going to fall down and spill out gas? Flasks contain liquid, I'm pretty sure. And there wasn't a cork on it, so I'm not sure if it could contain gas. Maybe it's magical gas. Uh, what's in here? What's in the magical gas container? Is it back here? Oh, in the slightly more magical area. This is where all the magic is coming from. Hey, Emmy! There's a strange mist in this flask, too! But it's somehow different from that mist outside. I don't know. It feels kind of comforting. Ah, oh, this is nice mist. It's like a sauna in here. A really strange sauna in a pot, a flask. So, what do we gotta do? We're stuck in a, a flask. It's really comforting, apparently. Do we, why would the Emperor hide a flask here? I don't know, Ishin. Can you help me out? Hmm, it might be this mist bottled up here that he's hi hiding. Uh, let's find a way to make the mist go away, like, make the mist come out of the pot. Let's blow it up! That didn't work. Oh, wait, this is a better idea. Duh. Gale storm. Wow. <laughs> Use your brain, Dr. Oswald. Gosh. Wow. See, there's my uh, my brain power right there, activating. Wow, you're getting good at that one. Almost too good. I don't know why the Emperor hit the, this flask here, but he shouldn't be hogging such comforting mist all to himself. Yeah, really, it's really nice. Oh, uh, one second, guys. Uh, no, wait, never mind. Hey, it's that starlight again. What's it doing here? One second, guys, I need to fix my, uh, my power cord on my computer. Be right back. Okay, there we go. I'm back, guys. Anyway, um, the strange mist is being strange, I guess. Um, yes. And there's starlight. So, we're, I guess we're learning a new brush technique again. Let's see what it is. Uh, what are we going to get in the sky today? That looks like a sheep with an orb on its back. Let's put some dots down. Yeah, here we go. 
Oh, you can get you can do it. There we go. Bang! One try. Awesome. It looks like a large sheep. And it is a large sheep with a flask on its back. It's drinking out of it. It's blowing comforting mist everywhere. And it's falling, and it fell down on its face. Poor thing. Looks so nice and happy. Oh, what? Oh, what? What's it doing? Whoa! It's taking a drink. And <laughs> what? Uh, what are you doing, sheep? The sheep has magic powers. Oh, that sheep didn't use its magic powers very well. It got hit. <laughs> it appears that it got hit with a bunch of those, like, shamisens, or instruments, I don't know what they are. This is Kasugami. Ah, Hamaratsu. Origin of all that is good and mother to us all. After our separation, I took to wandering the corners of the earth. Before long, I was sealed away here by a sinister power. Your arrival has broken that seal. Now, I, Kasugami, grant you the power of mist. Listen over all creation like fleeting dew. Oh, thank you. Where's our, our power up? Oh, there it is. It's floating again. And. <gasps> Score! We got another brush technique, guys. Awesome. So that's why the Emperor hid this flask. Like it was treasure. Kasugami, the god of mist, was trapped inside. They say Kasugami can wrap the world in a thick mist that slows down time for all things really did feel like I was in a dream world with no sense of time. A lot. But enough of that. That's one awesome power you just got back, Amy. If the legend's true, that brush can technique can slow down. Any monster with a single stroke, even a blocking spider. Let's try out that new power of yours right away, Amy. Okay, oh, that looks like the lines we need to make. Two horizontal lines across the screen. Just draw the marks that they're that are there on the flask. That'll show those pe that pesky spider who's boss. Yes, spider. Guess what? Oh, I have to wait for. Oh no! Huh? Nothing happened. Was it really nothing but a legend? Sure can draw that mark there's on the flask. Slow down the monster. Oh no! Ish, and I just went out the brush thing because you have to wait till he's all the way up there. There we go. Or that's how I get out of the room most of the time. Look, there he goes, really slow. Actually, I should have done it while he was down. Whoa, what the? The blocking spider slowed down. That really is Kasagami's legendary time-slowing technique. Wow, Amy, you really pack quite an arsenal of techniques. Blocking spiders should be a piece of cake from now on. We'll slow down anything in our way, no matter how fast it is. I figured out something else, too. The Emperor must have a screw loose or something. I mean, why would he possibly want to trap Kasugami in there? I bet it has everything to do with that swirling mist out there. Okay, we're gonna block this guy from the door. No! Okay, there we go. We made it out. Yeah, we've just achieved the powers of mist from Kasugami. Oh, we're being attacked. Uh, that's a wind mirror, I believe. It has a picture of an old dude on it. And they move really fast. Later, we'll like meet we'll meet like a demon wheel that that's like a nose, and those are the ones that move really fast. I think, I, if I'm not mistaken. Eat some bullets, yeah. I have a slice of my skills. Skill pizza, right there, yeah. I'm gonna slow down time on your face. Boom, boom. Oh, let's slow down time. Slow down time. Ooh, he gives you three demon fangs. That is a nice mirror. Thank you, mirror. I actually got a floral finisher. Yay. Congratulations for me, I guess. Oh, anyway, let's just head on up here to wherever. Oh, we need to go save that girl. Kakuya, I guess, and find a way into the palace. We haven't made it in there yet. Oh, but it's coming up on the end of the episode. So I'd like to say, I will see you guys on the next episode of Let's Play Okami. Bye, guys.